What's up guys, this is Levi. I just got back, I'm gonna show you guys kind of what I got going on in the south side down here. But uh, I am rider number 152 for Fast Dads. Um, me and Casey are teaming up to get this uh, team up and rolling, but uh, kind of give you a little rundown on the south, uh, south end of the United States, what Fast Dads got going on. I work on the road. So as you can see, I live in campground. And I get all my stuff for the bikes shipped to the campground. And uh, got a new set of tires for it. Plastic straight from YCF. But uh, let me show you kind of how things go in the pit bike world down here. So when you ain't got a lot of room, just put your bike in the camper this is my little home away from home as you can see it's valentine's day and i have a wife and two daughters so got to make that special but uh but this is it 2018 leftover 2018 piranha 190 um picked it up from a guy in south carolina um, i'm actually stationed in north carolina right now but i drove down to south carolina and picked this up got a good deal on it the guy, uh, he did some uh, supermoto on it, and uh, that's why you can see right now I don't got <laughs> good tires on it, so that's why I ordered tires, but he did supermoto on it. It's never, as far as what he's told me, it's never seen a dirt track before, which we are going to change that. Um, it did not come with these bars. It came with stock Piranha bars, stock Piranha grips. Um, um, on my big bike, I've always raced with the Pro Taper RM mid Wyndham bends and the Pro Taper pillow top grips. So, as you might have uh, heard in one of uh, the pre previous videos, I am only five foot six and I weigh probably a buck fifteen. So this bike fits me well. So I'm trying to set it up as close to my big bike as I can. So, um, just a quick rundown of my plans for the bike um i race yamahas so i'm not a red fan all the red is going to be gone that's why we're going with the blue um casey in pennsylvania is my my new plastics full plastics kit um they're being shipped to him he's going to take them up to mx graphics which if you guys haven't heard of mx graphics you need to go back and watch the previous video because I've known those guys my whole life since I was on 50s. Um, Eric and Scott are amazing guys. They will hook you up. Definitely check them out. For the past six years, I haven't run any graph any other graphics, and I don't plan to. They've always been good graphics, always been good guys, always helped me out, and I'll always, always stick by them as long as they're in business. But uh, So those plastics you've seen outside, those are just um, a white number plate, white front fender, just so I can get rid of the red. Um, I do have, I did get a blue seat cover in the mail. I'm pretty sure they sent me the wrong one, but once my wife gets here, she's on her way here from Georgia to spend Valentine's Day with me, but when she gets here, we're going to see if we can get this red seat off and the blue seat on. And uh, I do have some odds and ends stuff I'm going to do to it, but I just want to give you guys a quick rundown on what I got going on here. It's kind of hard to do a whole lot in the camper when you don't got a whole lot of room and when it gets dark out but um i'm gonna i got super reg full-on supermoto wheels in the storage space in the camper which i'm going to put on this take these tires off tonight and have my wife take them to the shop up the road have them throw the tires on because i just don't have big enough tools to you know big enough screwdrivers or tire tools to put the, the tires on so she's gonna do that for me but uh that's the plan and uh Good morning guys, as you can see, we have everything ready to get loaded up and we are going to head out to the track, get some riding in, I'm going to get some helmet cam shots for you guys and whatnot, and uh, kind of dial the bike in today, see what we can do about suspension and uh, just stuff like that, so we're going to we're gonna take her out today and it's a beautiful Sunday here and here in Cheryl's Ford, North Carolina, as you can see. 
this beautiful day out. It's so right now around 52 degrees. It's gonna, I think, get up to like 60. So uh, we're gonna get the uh, get the bike loaded up, and then uh, we'll be on our way. seen on the video um, the, on the ride took a pretty nasty uh, get off there on the first lap first freaking straightaway it was a uh, track looked good I was just going out and giving her hell and hit a mud spot that was really really deep didn't anticipate it bent my brake lever all kinds of up pulled my grip up lost my vent tube or fuel cap uh, Lost one of my uh, fork guards. Um, had it wasn't fun. I pretty sure I broke my for sure broke my left hand pointer finger knuckle, um, and I have blood coming from somewhere. I don't know where it is, but oh uh, yeah, I just uh, 
Got a little carried away. Just didn't think to go out there and get a feel for the track before I went out there. 